annoying phone calls had to put the phone down people do me so wrong falling out of love now life move fast so i'm always on the go now that's just how it goes that's just how it goes living life out on the road living life out on the road running out of real love gave it all away it's me it's me simba tv YouTube fam, it's your boy Simba coming back here again with another reaction video for you guys today. For today's reaction video, we got Up Church chilling in the new Holla Boy room. Let's jump up in it. <laughs> I love how he's listening to Rolling Stone <laughs> while getting stoned. <coughs> <coughs> Shot fire! <laughs> Very nice technicals. Jeez. We'll find them in a minute. I've been working my ass off, dude. What's up? <laughs> my, my name is George Nelson, not Babyface. Man, one thing people should never lose is that that love for themselves, you know? Just like being able to be alone with yourself and let your imagination just run. Because as kids, we used to do that all the time, you know? We used to be in the living room just playing by ourselves and just letting our imagination run and just, you know, building things and, and just talking to ourselves and just running around and just having fun. And that's one thing that I truly, truly love about church because he can sit in a room by himself and just play music and just, you know, just fucking be goofy and just smoke and just be completely alone and be okay with that and love that and love that space, love his me time, you know, because I'm truly like that. Like I, I'm literally... Just always chilling in my office, just fucking saying random things, doing random things, creating things in my head. Like, I love that. Like, that imagination. I don't want anybody to let go of that, man. Never spoke to folks around and didn't have too much to say. No one dared to ask his business, no one dared to make a slip. The ranger there among them with the big gun on his head. Big on his Big I fell into a burning ring of fire And it burned, burned, burned And the flames went up higher And it burned, burned, burned The ring of fire And you know, lay it on a farm When she did And Jesus always walked close by our side And I feel you crumbling Oh, 
National Guard. Call Jesus. Uh, yeah, I'm calling to report an apocalypse. Uh, outside. <laughs> There's a big war here. There's evidence everywhere. Man, what about the acorn cup, though, dude? How'd you lose your job? Well, I got scared of squirrel food. Man. Much nuts. It's pretty much the only thing I know about that's like happening on the internet, the acorn cop. That chick cop from a while back that was fucking the police. She's like, oh, phew, I'm free. They're not gonna think about me anymore. They're gonna think about this fucking guy. The first <laughs> words out of his mouth when he's walking past the cop car sound fucked up. He said, God, on fire! So my I was about to say that, dude. He was like, I'm hit, I'm hit. The dude's like, where? He's like, I don't know. Like, what the fuck, bro? Like. Bro, you started shooting into your own car with someone handcuffed back there. Like, and then you missed every shot as well. Thank God, you know, that you're a horrible shooter. But, like, you just almost killed someone for no reason, bro. And my whole thing is logic, logically, logically, if someone's handcuffed in the back of your car, how are they shooting at you from inside the car? Like let's 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 just think that one through. If someone is handcuffed in the back of your cop car, how are they shooting at you from inside the cop car? They're handcuffed. Like you checked them. You're the one that put them in there. You patted them down. Like obviously they didn't have no weapons. Like come on, big dog. Like that shit. That whole thing pissed me off. Like it really did. It really did. <laughs> Making all kind of fucked up noises. I bet his legs like turned to rubber. Like they were like fucking quadruple jointed. They were just like jiggling like this. Dude, his knees turned into springs. Like big old springs. What the fuck? If you're less scared, you probably shouldn't be that. Facts. Bro, God forbid you'd have fucking bumped into the little squirrel thing on the ice age. You thought that was a fucking terrorist or something. Go, <laughs> Dear acorn cop dude, if you ever go to the bathroom and it's cold, don't worry. Don't run. It's just your dick. <laughs> <laughs> then this motherfucker is like, I'm shot, shot, I'm shot. Crazy. You're shot. What, dude? How the fuck did you become a cop? 
crazy. <gasps> then is the other cop lady. He's over here in this fucking nice neighborhood with fucking Blue Jays and Cardinals taking baths in fucking people's puddles of water and shit. It's like <laughs> super quiet. All she hears is fucking dipshit over here fucking <laughs> And she runs up there she's like what what what? She probably thinks he got stung by a wasp or something. He's like oh, fuck, what? And she's like what what? And he's like the car. Dang. Bro, I feel kind of sorry for the female guy. If I'm not mistaken, is it a Jeep Liberty she's hiding behind? A Jeep Liberty. Liberty. <laughs> yeah, Jeep's gonna be like, fucking blur my shit out of this, please. Bro, the most pathetic part is the body cam footage from the female cop. <laughs> when she runs over there, he's like crawling across the street like it's a fucking comedy. Movie. Man. What is this, 21 Jump Street? You ain't even jumping. You're crawling and rolling. Keep rolling, rolling. He about did, dude. He rolled like two blocks. Sure Show did. Shit, bro. Give this man a Firestone shirt with all this rolling down the street he's doing. Now he done got fired. He's probably somewhere like us getting stoned now. <laughs> so, yeah. He's probably listening to Rolling Stone. <laughs> his ass is finna be scarred for life. Or just evolve into having like a nut allergy. Imagine if the corn kid was popping right now and the cop like seen the corn kid selling lemonade. He's like, oh, hi, kid, you selling lemonade? He's like, I like corn. The cop starts crying in the lemonade. He's like, <laughs> bro, he was talking about corn, not acorn. It still sounds the same. <laughs> I mean, still it's not really the same. a bright side, but I guess if you're big on English or language, you can say you'll do anything at the drop of a hat because you'll do some crazy shit at the drop of a fucking acorn. I mean, dude, imagine what was going through the guy's head who's handcuffed. It has no gun on the inside of the car. Ima Literally, bro, that's all I can think about. It's like, that has to be a moment of fear like no other, you feel me? Because, like, you're sitting here being, you're already handcuffed. You're already in the back of this cop car so your mind is already like fuck like you know like what's gonna happen to me and then you just start hearing bullets fly towards you from both directions because now this other officer is shooting into the car and you're just like sitting there like yo yo like that has to be terrifying bro like that has to be just like the utmost like fear ever Imagine what that fucking dude's thinking. My brain would have shitted itself. I'd have been like, wait a minute, what? Like, for real, think about that. You're in the cop car, you got your hands behind your back. You're like, man, fuck this fucking dude. You see him walking past the car. He's walking by. He's not even looking at you because the windows are tinted. He's looking somewhere down the street. And you're watching him. And all of a sudden, you see him go, Row, row! And then do a bunch of rolls. And you're like, wait a minute. You hear him going, fire, fire, fire! And you're like, huh? And you're like looking around to see what's going on. And then he starts shooting at you. Oh, man. And then somehow all the bullets miss you and you don't even get hit. Like, bro, what kind that of alternate part. universe is this? Dude, this is levels above a Mandela effect. This motherfucker in the car, he drank a damn manslaughter potion. He, like, as soon as he woke up, he was like, let me mix up a little shield. Let's roll. And they're like, yo, cop, what'd you drink this morning? He's like, ah, well, I accidentally peed in my mouth. So I was, I was good. I didn't need nothing to drink after that. But yeah, let's see, uh, what else? Anything interesting? Uh, I mean, not internet wise, but I went to Dick's and had a thing happen. Just walking around and I was like, man, I've been looking for some ping pong balls and some ping pong paddles. You know, I like to fucking balance shit and stuff. You know, if you watch my Instagram, I'll be flipping and doing fucking all kind of tricks and shit. Anyways, I see these. I'm like, damn, it's ping pong paddles for a fucking blind person. I'm blind, so I bought it. And then I get to the counter and the girl, she's like, oh, you pickleball? And I was like, <laughs> is that a trick question? What does that mean, pickleball? That don't sound appealing. I didn't have my glasses, but I thought she was like, afterwards, like, you pickleball? Uh, I was like, listen, lady, I've already been to court with too many of y'all. I don't even want any of these things anymore. As a matter of fact, I'm, I'm allergic to pickles. Like, <laughs> I'm allergic to cop pickles. Cop is allergic to <laughs> common sense. She's like, oh, no, 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 it's a sport. And I'm like, what's a sport? Court or pickleball? Because <laughs> I don't know at this point. It was a weird thing, but, you know, I got them. I felt bad. I thought you were trying to lure me somewhere and, like, knock me out. And then I was going to be on the Nashville news or something, you know. I've been through a lot of shit lately. Right, then I felt like a dick inside dicks. So I'm like, yeah, fuck this, I'm going home. But yeah.
pickleball. But yeah, that's all I feel like saying right now. I don't feel like uh, saying and recording anything else. So this is the end of the video. <laughs> Bye. Oh, man. <laughs> The church, man. I love when church just does videos like this, man. If you guys like this video, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button for me. Thank you guys for commenting, sharing, and subscribing. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.